Friday evening after Thanksgiving. <clears throat> Just had to dough come through the food plot here. Put a shot on her at about 18 yards or so. I think I might have hit a little high. I'm gonna wait a little bit, get down and check my arrow. Okay, here we go on the recovery mission for my deer that I shot Friday evening. <clears throat> it's now Sunday morning. This is where I just happened to be walking through this dry creek bed. Came across a blood trail. This creek is actually the property line between me and my neighbor. And it's so far away from where I shot the deer, I thought it was, because there's a stand, as you can see, right over there on the neighbor's property. I thought somebody had shot a deer out of that stand there. But then, examining the blood trail a little closer, all of the splatters from the blood indicated that the deer was headed towards the neighbor's property. So we ended up tracking it down. Found her probably 70, 80 yards from right here. And there she is. She was actually tucked in right there. I think she crawled up under that root wad of that tree <clears throat> and died. And then the coyotes pulled her out. There she is. There's the exit hole, which looks like it got one lung, I guess. But she was, was at a pretty steep angle. I was pretty high up in the tree. So it must have got one lung or a piece of a lung, high in the lung. <clears throat> 